Hey, what's going on guys? Cryptos and Cryptic Wisdom here and today I bring you another plugin tutorial on warps. Now before you guys continue watching this video, this is not based on U Essentials warps. This is a different warp plugin and technically it's still the same as U Essentials setting up warps. If you guys can differentiate the two, then you should be fine setting it up on new essentials. However, the permissions is different. So if you guys are installing this plugin, then you guys can continue watching. So we're going to start by downloading the warp plugin. Let's click the download button. And we're going to open our unturned folder. And I'm using a, another test server. So we're going to put the warp plugin in the plugins folder and we're going to start the server so as you can see here servers loaded and warps has been loaded so we're going to go back into our plugins and you see a warps folder edit with notepad plus plus and this is the config so if you guys have economy enabled and installed properly on your server you can use that this type in true and if you want players to be charged as soon as they use let's say slash set warp or slash warp another warp you can set that to true that means if you have your comment enabled they'll be taken let's say 200 for doing warp other so since the economy is set as false basically all this would be disabled and would not work at all. Now if you want the enabled weight groups, so certain groups doing slash warped will have a cooldown and you can set the cooldown here so the group name basically if we go to permissions. See our permissions here and it's basically the ID, so default and the cooldown is 10. Let's say you got VIP. Just add a group which is VIP and you can change the wait time. If you want everyone to have a if you want everyone to have the same wait time then you can have the all properly here or you can remove it if you want to have separate groups with separate wait times. Now you can enable the movement restrictions so basically as soon as they type slash warp the warp name and they have a cooldown as soon as they move the warp will cancel. So we're going to leave everything at default here and we can go ahead and save it. So going back to our rocket mod warp page and these are the permissions so you're going to have to have permission to warp which obviously allows them to do slash warp and the next thing is warp.other so basically if you want a let's say your friend and you want to tp him to a warp then you can add this permission and the warp charge override that means if you have economy enabled obviously and set that to true then adding this permission into a group, they won't be charged at all. You can have the set warp permission, so we're going to have to add that in. We're going to add more templates of permissions, so set warp allows them to set a warp. And their warp allows them to delete a warp that they set. And their warp all. Basically, if you want them to delete all warps and warps for a list of all warps, and we're gonna save that. So, we're gonna go ahead and reload the warp plugin and also reload permissions by p reload. Now that we join the server, you can do slash p to view your permissions. And as you can see, I have the permissions right here. And we're going to start by the permission set warp. 
and we're going to name this for example home so warp has been set if you do slash warps see warp home and type slash warp home be teleported to warp home now if you want to delete your warp then you can do slash del warp home hope you guys enjoy and see you guys next time